I thought about it. Why not take artists up that got it moving? Why not fuck with artists that's about to be moving? Why not? I want to be early. I want to be the first to stand by it. That's what I do. We move it. You see it. Listen, man. Oh, man. We're comfortable. We outside. I got my guy with me. Like, like let them know if they were under a rock. Who I'm with, man? Hey, cool to be himself. I ain't Y'all know. <laughs> Google. Look it up. K double O D A. B, don't forget it. Yeah. They know. I love it. My boy moving. And we moving. Kuda, man. Ah, man. First of all, I'm mad that it took us this long. Right. Like, it, it took us, it, it's a super delayed, but it still feels good. How are you feeling regularly? Before we get to all of the good, the bad, the ugly, how are you feeling regularly? I'm just letting life play out, bro. Yeah. Living my life, that's it. Turn it up. I'm gonna be, be me regardless. You yeah. know what I mean? Any situation, I'm always gonna be me. Always on. I'm a regular. What's life? Where you from? For the people from that don't know. From Brownsville, Brooklyn. Yeah. On the way, Southern Mother Gaston. Yeah, all know. <laughs> Y'all hear <it> every song. <laughs> <laughs> hey, dog. Born and raised in Brownsville, bro. Yeah. I mean, for a foreigner, let's put him. Let's put him in that in that driver's seat. You're in Brownsville. We all heard a million stories about it. So there's this kid right now in Indiana that doesn't know what the fuck a Brownsville is. Walk him oh, through it. What is it like? Poor, rich, ugly, dangerous, safe? Walk, it's, you know? it's, it ain't safe. It's, <laughs> it's what you make it. It's what you make it. If, if you make it peaceful, it's going to be peaceful. You're going to get right by it. You make it hard for yourself, you're going to make it hard for yourself. But... Now you feel me? Everybody just been positive for lately. Everybody been positive, bro. Yeah. Everybody been on their own thing, trying to do what they do. Get out the hood. Everybody trying to make it out. Yeah. Everybody trying to be in there all their life. Yo, I I was today. I was randomly looking at some shit, and one of my old interviews pulled up, and I had interviewed Lil Bibby, and I asked him the weirdest question, and it got like the spookiest answer I ever heard. What's the first? How old were you when you had to deal with death? In reference to like one of your friends. Oh, so I was like, like eleven. I was like eleven. No cap. What's that like? Put us in that whole story. That's, what happened? Like that's different. I seen my man die in front of me. When like you were eleven. eleven. Yeah, the basketball game. Facts. Oh shit. Long, long Straight and shot or was it. targeted? Nah, it wasn't targeted. It was just firing at everybody. Rapid fire. He was firing at a crowd. At my man. Does that, at 11 years old, are you even conscious enough to go like, yo, that could have been me? Or are you like, nah, this is crazy? Because like, 11, you still, you're at that you're at that border where it's like, I'm kind of a young adult, kind of still a kid. Like, yeah. did you even understand the magnitude of that shit? No, I don't know. I'm, 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 I'm still like, to this day, I'm like, what the fuck? I don't really, that shit is crazy. That shit is crazy. Yeah. We're playing like that. That shit is crazy. OD. Bibby said some shit. It was like single digits. I think it was like eight or nine. And then he said, since about eight or nine, he said that he felt like he's seen almost 60 of his friends die. And I just... I'm from Brooklyn. I'm from the Floss. But when I hear numbers like 60, I'm like, yeah, Chicago was a fucking war zone. You know what I mean? Like, that's is it... Crazy. Would you... It's a cheesy question, but it's unique. Would you ever wish that you grew up in these privileged, in Connecticut, in New Jersey, in Virginia, you know, one of these privileged areas? You, are you happy that you came from? I'm happy I came from Boston, yeah. but that shit made me a monster. Made me learn a lot, see a lot. Yeah. For me, learn from people's mistakes. I've seen a lot, for me. I'm glad I grew up there. It made me the geek, the geek himself. Yeah. How did... Hey, no, come on. I think that's the most unique balance about you. Is because when I first, when I'm first seeing you, right, the first time I'm seeing you, man, I couldn't tell you who the first person. To, maybe Op might have been the first person to put me on to you. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, on point Op yeah, tonight. You know what I mean? Um, and it was just like this, or maybe, maybe even SD. But I was just like. What's up with this kid? It's like one second you just angry, rap, 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 and then the next second you in there just laughing and having fun. Yeah, like, what gives you that balance to look at life like that? I, I like rapping, the rapping. You know, some people be scared, like scared to do stuff. They scared what people will say. I don't give a fuck. Mm-hmm. But nobody say I'm gonna do what I want. I'm gonna rap about what I. You feel me? I'm gonna rap, dance regardless. Yeah. 
like I'm in forty still dancing. <laughs> That ass, you gotta have moves though if you go I'm gonna have moves all my life. I'm the young MJ. I'm the GOAT. I'm the GOAT. Yeah. That's crazy. So dancing just always been, it never was like, I'm too hard to dance. No. Never, never. It's just like, fuck it. Yeah, I love it. I love dancing. What's high school like? You play ball? Football? Yeah. Ball? High school. High school. I ain't, I ain't played no sports. Before high school, I played football for six years. Then I went to boys and girls. Transfer. I went to Jeff. Chancellor from Jeff, then I graduated high school. I went to um, Rose Charter High School. Graduated. Yeah. Oh, so you finished school? Yeah, hell yeah. Hell and yeah, and these niggas be thinking you're a dumbass. Oh, no, I'm not dumb. <laughs> they know I'm not dumb. High school diploma, definitely. Yeah. You gotta have that. What, see, I think that's a unique thing about you, too, is that you continue to just go pop back up at these schools. Why? Why? I hate to be ignorant, but why even care? I, I don't I, I I see me and them kids. All the kids I see me and them. Like hmm. I was once their age. So I know how I feel when somebody special that they really like come to their school. And they pop excited, out. yeah. Excited. I'd be happy to make their day. Yeah. OD, I'd be OD happy to make their day. At what point did you figure out that you actually mattered enough to go to a school? Because, you know, there's a difference of wanting to do it and then going and being like, oh shit, they actually can't. I cared realized, about. like, I wrote on Snap. I'm like, this how I wrote my snap. I'm like, yo, who want me to come up to their school? My snap went crazy. I'm like, over like a thousand people wrote me. I'm like, oh yeah, it's over. I gotta go up to the school. Yeah. Went up to the school. I went up to my first school. What school I went up to first? My first time ever, I think. Oh, it was Kanasi, 211. Crazy. I went up to 211. It was crazy. I went to I'm like, nah. That's crazy. I was like, nah, 211 go. I went. They went crazy. I'm like, yeah, it's lit. So you just so popped out when it's on the let out and just went crazy. Just, I didn't even tell them I was coming either. I'm like, oh, what's the address? They sent me the address. I didn't tell them when I was coming. I just popped up. I see you standing on calls. You threw a lot. Facts. Yo, man. You, you definitely been making a lot of noise. So, Kuda B starts to pick up. What's the moment? What's the first moment where you like, oh, shit, I start to matter? Not just to the kids, like, musically. What's the record? Is it Wu Back? What's the f it was, um... Yeah, yeah, hell yeah. Woo back, definitely. That's when I started realizing, like, it's a whole different ball game now. Everybody started noticing me. Yeah. Kids, all the kids start writing me every day, telling me paragraphs and how they feel. That's when I know it was different after that. I'm like, yeah, it's different. It's game time. Yeah. No more playing. I just started making music that the kids love. Yeah. Dancing. <laughs> making up all these dances. Kids love me. They love me. Yeah, that shit where you just... They love me, bro. They love me. Um, you yell out F-O-A a lot. Yeah, F-O-A family over all. Those are my brothers. Yeah. Facts. How important is that? I mean, it's obvious, but how important is it really? Oh, damn, boy. That's what I started with. F-O-A. F-O-A be not a game. Mm -hmm. That's when the dance came out. I made that song. And I know. After that, Pain overnight. Too. Facts. Overnight. It happened overnight. I might be going to lie. Then, you see, like, like I blew up overnight, you feel me? I ain't get OD high, I just made a little internet viral overnight. After that, you feel me? I kept going consistently, consistent, 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 consistent. Kept dropping, kept dropping. They was just loving it. I just kept going, that's it. It's crazy. And I ain't stopping. I'm definitely not Where did you? Where do you consider that you blew at? Was it YouTube or was it yeah, Facebook? Because I know nah, Facebook. Big. Facebook. You're big on Facebook, crazy. I love Facebook. <laughs> I love Facebook. I am Facebook. Like, I love Facebook. That's it? Yeah. Nobody got Facebook like you right nah, now? nobody got Facebook like me. Nobody. Nobody. I go live right now. I'm getting a thousand off the bat. You're just sitting here chilling. Clean. Clean. I, I, I get it. Fact, and when you bro. post this up, they're going to be like, he shot this? That's a fact. <laughs> That's crazy. So, Wubak, bring me through the discography. How does it go in reference to successful records? It was like, um... I did Blicky's Funeral first. No, first I started with Pain Part 2. That's when I first did the dance. Okay. That's when me and three of my friends, boom. Did That's Pain in the park? Part two. Yeah. Boom, I did Pain Part 2. Uh, the dance got hot, started smoking. After that, I did um, I did Blicky's Funeral. Yeah. That smoked. Then I did Wu Back. I just start doing stuff that add right up, you feel me? I start after that, I did Fess Me Up. After Fess Me Up, I did Cool to Be How You Do That. Then I did back to back with Bleezy, then I did Cool to Be How You Do That. Cool to Be How You Do That. I know, that. I know. I, was by, by that point, I was already. Yeah. So let's bring it back. A lot of people, I, I, I've always asked this, what is, what's woo to you? 
Because this is like the I biggest. I don't know what other people, that means we on our own. That's why our name is for old. we on our own. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know about other people. I don't know. Yeah, that's like everybody fights over yeah. the word now, yeah. who invented it, who did it. I I, my whole stance on the whole Wu shit is just, if you fucking with Wu, then just be happy that it's big. Yeah, you get what I'm saying? Because I know there are some people that I know that, that formed it to be like, yo, we got to kind of strengthen. Yeah. Because, you know what I mean? I don't, got, you know I don't I mean? know about none of that shit. I know about me and, you feel me? What I, like I told you, I mean, for me, I really mean like that we on our own. Yeah. Me? That's it. Only day one, bro. Does Everybody. it? The, see, the thing is like this. A lot of people was, like when you, when you come out with a diss record, Right, mm -hmm. or a record that, that goes at niggas, everybody goes, it's like clout chasing. Do you believe that every, like what is clout chasing? Clout chasing is, there's no clout chasing, do what you want. Yeah. I, 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 don't, I don't really pay, I don't pay people no mind, bro. Yeah. I don't pay people no mind. Clout chasing to me is, let me see. Dick somebody, yeah, dick line, trying to be, trying to be somebody they not. If you like, you really know them. You yeah. really know them. For me, cloud chasing. Just for the views, though. Yeah, just for the views. Yeah. But I'm not mad at nobody. You cloud chasing, you cloud chasing. Keep doing your thing. Keep if it's help you, if it's help you blow up, get hot. Keep doing your thing. Keep cloud chasing. That's what you gotta do to make it. How did it feel the first time when you were like, "Oh shit, I'm being cloud chased"? You know, be like with the first person that's like, first they don't know who the fuck you are. Facts. But Fuck who to be. I'm gonna fuck who to be up. You know, like this. First time, I'm just like, what? The fuck? Nah, this is weird. People don't know, nah, this is crazy. I say, I'm like, nah, this is getting crazy, crazy. What's that like? Without giving them shine, what's that first clock chase like? Oh, it's like, nah, at first you'll be like, oh, nah, what? You, you, you'll react for a second, me? I'll react for a second. I'm like, nah, nah, if I'm not even gonna write. Let me just be the bigger person. Let me just delete it. Ah, uh -huh. uh -huh. let me sit back. Yeah. Yeah, just sit back. Cause it's just it got it feels weird. You know what I mean? Like I get caught chased all the time when niggas be like, "Hey, gonna beat me out." They gonna slap you know? Yeah, like, they gonna slap like me. You know. I know. <laughs> I know. I, you know. Listen. <laughs> It's, yeah, it's I'm, a, I'm, I'm like a, I'm like an NBA shooting guard, <laughs> you know, like, I'm, yeah, I'll be honest, right. I'm six for six, I'm not, Fact. you know, but I laugh at it because so niggas get so frustrated with me because of who I've supported, mm -hmm. and niggas feel like it's one-sided and all that shit like that, I like to support, my, see, this is the thing, let's get back to humanity for a second, we go to Chinatown, yeah. it's all Chinese people. Chinese businesses, Chinese homes with Chinese people. They buy their shit, they sell to their shit, they go to their community. Right. You get me? Right. You go to a uh, fucking little Koreatown, you go to little Italy, you go to African neighborhoods. I, I, you know what I mean? I'll be in Flatbush, there's tons of Caribbeans. Okay. West Indians shop, live, breathe, party, and do what they own. So I've taken a little bit of my own, like, oh, I'm from this area of Brooklyn. I apologize. I've put on artists from Canarsie and Browns of the East, the high faster than other neighborhoods because it's like, this is my people. You get what I'm saying? And then, of course, niggas be like, oh, fuck Punch. He doesn't put me, you know, and it's like, I apologize, but these are the people that I connect with. And also, their stories connect with me better. So you tell me about Brownsville, I'm already, I already know what you're saying. Yeah. I know the street. I know a catty in your projects. I, you get what I'm saying? Like, I might have... <laughs> it was my buddy. She was That's cool. Exact. You get what I mean? My, my whole thing is... But there's there's a connection. People get so angry at it. How do you deal with people being angry at who you choose to stand with, who you do, want to do records with, who you want to stand by? How do you deal with that? I don't... Like I told you, <laughs> you don't I, don't, I don't care what nobody say. You can say what you want. A thousand mm -hmm. times... Niggas be cab, man. Y'all heard it, my son. Niggas be cab, man. I don't be playing that no mind, bro. People can talk all day. Words don't hurt, bro. Yeah. As long as I'm talking, I'm good. Yeah. Facts, bro. So. That just motivate me, though. Like, dumb hating motivate me more to keep going. Yeah. That's all it's done. So you just keep hating, and I'm gonna keep going. That's it just it. gets you bigger and bigger and bigger. Bigger and bigger. It's crazy. Who did you listen to growing up? I listened to. Uh. You can say, listen to 600, 
Mm, what's the uh, and it's a lot of uh, uh, speaker knockers. Hmm. Bleezy. Um. Hmm. DMX. Hmm. That's it, bro. I I ain't really. I wasn't really into music. Really? Honestly, I really wasn't. So what made you go to the studio the first time? Went to the studio because my guys, they're like, yo, let's go to the studio. All right, let's start making, uh, let's start rapping. I'm like, all right, come on. <laughs> let's go rap. Let's go rap. Come on, I'm with y'all. I'm back with my guys, 100%. Crazy. And I already had the Facebook cloud, you feel me? So I just started rapping, and they just went right with it. Oh, so you've been big on the book, just yeah. regular? Yeah, I've been big since like 2011. On Facebook. That's crazy. Mad long. I love Facebook. <laughs> I love Facebook. I love Facebook. I love Facebook. They need to give okay. you some bread for this, man. No cap. Mark Zuckerberg. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. No cap. Holla at me. I am Facebook. For real. That's lit. Alright. Um, I've been watching you. I'm seeing this shit. I like it. I'm paying attention. Then we kind of get forced. Our paths get really forced together with Takashi shit. Yeah. Explain how does how do you know Takashi? How did you get to know him? Alright. We met what's the name? We met um met like when I first did the dance. And I told you when I first got hot. Yeah. He hit me up when he was overseas. Like, yo, hard out. I wanna put a, a clip of your video. This one I wasn't taking the music serious. Yeah. He was like, I wanna put a clip of your video on my song, I'm like, ah, right, you could do it, but I don't care. I don't care yeah. about it. So he did it, and he like, when I come back to New York, I'm like, we gonna talk, bro, bro, bro. And he came back to New York, and he hit me up. We feel me, we linked up, spoke, and I, from there, facts, bro. So that was before, this is before Gummo? Yeah, this is way before Gummo, way before that. Mm, like the trippy right time? Mm-hmm. Poles and all that shit. Facts, bro. So, I put you in the my seat. I'm in the studio. The gummo shit is bubbling, they're like, yo, punch, pull up. I go to the studio to see the day that they're recording Kuda. I'm there. I actually have the footage when he tells his manager, like, I think I'm going to name it Kuda. Yeah, his manager, I, go, I have that. I'm the only nigga with that I shit. I went to gummo. I yeah. course I went to gummo. He wanted to shoot it like, like uh, Yeah. Because me, I don't like being around new people. I don't. I do not like, I don't I don't trust a lot of people. I don't like being around new people. Bro. Yeah. People I don't know, I like day ones. Well, I know I'm comfortable. I don't gotta worry about looking over my shoulder. Understood. Somebody hating on the side. I don't wanna worry about that. Yeah. Let me so. He told me to pull up the gummo though. I'm like, where's that? He told me it's in the stop. I'm like, nah, bro. I'm like, you can stay. <laughs> Do your thing, bro. You feel me? And that, that that wasn't the most peaceful side of the stop. Yeah. <laughs> nah. So. Yeah. And then bro. and then the cooler shit. So I'm there, and he goes. um, Yo, I'm gonna name it Kuda. And his manager goes, Why would what do you mean? He's like, I'm gonna name it Kuda. And his manager was just like, Because of Kuda? You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And he was like, Yeah, that'll be hot. It's gonna go viral. I have the clip. And I'm like, I'm like, and I so I asked him, I'm like, yo, who's I said, I said, Kuda, why Kuda? He's like, you know Kuda B? I said, Kuda B the rapper? Because I've never, you got to understand, this is the first time that I've ever heard a nigga name a song yeah. about another rapper, rapper yeah. who's not his team, not in the area, not around. I'm like, huh? He's like, yeah. And I'm like, okay. And he's like, yeah, it's going to be lit. I got a vision. And I was just like, this nigga is either a genius or a, a retard or an idiot. I mean, I said, you know, like, and I'm just like, this shit is crazy. And then I remember that day, we're waiting for you, and you pull up, you know, Fine. seven, eight hours late. Go to the video. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah. Because look, I was there the whole time. I swear, I was there. I was watching. I'm just like, nah, that's too. That's not me. <laughs> I don't like new people. I kept calling like, bro, you really want me to come? Nah, bro. I don't like to be. It was a lot of niggas. Like yeah, that. it was too much, bro. So that's why I waited to that scene and you see me in the um. In the car. That's when we yeah, walked into each other. Yeah, and I'm like, yo, why you pulling up now? Don't worry, it's gonna turn up now. And then niggas went to the train, and then I was just. I was annoyed by that time because what's happening is I guess all the gang niggas is like, oh, punch is here, right here. Look, gang, I'm from set. Bah, 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 bah. Yeah. I rap, da, da, da. I'm like, yo, bro, we're turning this this rap moment into gangland. Yeah. You get what I mean? And I understand that gang and rap mixes, but it started to get. You know what I'm about to cut up? Because niggas are just it's too okay. much. Fair. You get what I'm saying? It's just it's too much. 
possibility of it. You get what I'm saying? A negativity. So I try my best to show the gang shit, show the unity, to show that the nine was there, to show that GSC was there, the Billy's mm -hmm. was there, Mac Bowlers, all one wave, and it was calm. It was calm. You get what I'm saying? That's about, the best that I try to do. And then just left it like that. Yeah. So how does the relationship develop from that point on? What you had? It was still how it was. Like we would call each other here and there. Oh, what's up? You good? You good? You good? Yeah, he keep telling me like send him move back, send him move back. And I, I always would be like, alright, I'm gonna send it, I'm gonna send it. Yeah. At, at that time, I couldn't find a foul, so I just kept, oh, I'm gonna send, it, I'm gonna send it, bro. I got you. Yeah. And we was always like that, bro. It was never. We used to get that every day. Not like that. No, I mean I know that part. Facts. You get what I'm saying? I know that part. You know, I was around, I was around them a lot in those. Uh, early stages and with the shows and mm -hmm. trying to get you to come out. You get what I'm saying to do shows because it's like <laughs> this is my shit. You gotta yeah. by that point, look Takashi shit. I've I would have by that point in my career, I've already successfully started and broke Young M.A. from start to finish. We go, we take that record to what 14 on Billboard. Then we went. I was active with Fresher, active with Cass even early, active with Cardi early. You get what I'm saying? So I'm like, alright, cool, I'm here with another artist. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. Now you're bubbling, so let's let's really do it. Yeah. And he already had a um a liking to it and it made mad sense. And I remember being like, yo bro, this is this is like the biggest record in the world. Take advantage of the moment. Yeah. It's named after you. And then I you was like I just remember you was just like, yo, cool be how I do that, how you do that, how you do that, how you do that. And I'm just like I bro, you putting a lot of weight on this one song, bro. And then you, it just came, and then, whew. how does that moment happen now? The way that you find you at that point now have a super successful record. Probably labels is calling all that shit. Like, it was regular, like <laughs> I told you, I don't be, I don't be caring, bro. I really don't care, bro. I just do what I want, bro. Yeah. I really don't care. I just have fun with it, bro. I like to have fun with it, bro. I like to have fun. That's it, bro. Like at that point, I'm just like, all right. Master plan, what's next? That's it. Master plan, what's next? Let me go in the cut. Let me sit in the crib for two, three days. Feel me? Mm -hmm. Let me look on the internet. Let me see, see what's next. And that's it. See bro. what car was there doing next. Facts. Let me see. Yo, bro, I, I, this is a taxi cab nigga right now. That what's the fuck you mean? <laughs> <laughs> like, I remember looking at it, and I don't know if my brain is just twisted. I'm like, yo, them niggas is wowing on that cab. <laughs> <laughs> That shit fun though, man. Like you, I can't front everything that you say. You do it like the fun you having it, bro. You doing it? Was it ever? Does at that point did it become a belief that you could actually get out of Brownsville at that point? Yeah, it became like like at the walk back. At the walk back, I'm like, yeah, I know I can make it up. I know I can make it up. Yeah, it's not hard. I'm getting views, putting on numbers going up. I'm like, yeah. I know I'm just gonna keep going. So why no label? Mm. People were hollering like, at yeah. that. What? <laughs> so why? Why, why not get the bag? Highs, bro. It's just like I feel like I, I could get it on my own, bro. I could get it on my own. It's not hard. It's not the internet is there for you to go. It's not hard. Mm -hmm. I feel like I get it on my own, bro. Facts. I like to keep it home team, bro. So you felt like if you'd have went at that point, it would have been a little mm -hmm. bit like Takashi's friend. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Ah, like, I get it, I get it, I get I'm it. I'm hot cause six no. I was been hot before I even met him. Feel me? Mm -hmm. Go look it up. Well, look at the numbers. Ben had a million before I even met him. Ben mm -hmm. touching minutes. Yeah, Fact. that's a fact. Blinky Funeral was a over a million. Facts. Woo back. Oh, I say, yeah. Wow. So you didn't... See, that's such a unique thing. I guess that's... I mean... Again, I guess that's that same shit where it's like, that's your confidence gotta be at a million. Mm -hmm. To be like, I'm gonna pass on all of this shit now. Just so I could stand firmly on my own too. Yeah, I get it. I did that too. I had when 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 MA was going on tour, I quit probably like a handful of days right before the tour, and people thought I was on drugs. And I just literally <laughs> was like, I didn't like the situation no more. I quit. I walked away Fact. when it was hot as shit. Cause you gotta have confidence in kind of what you want to do. Mm -hmm. So I I respect it a million percent. At that point, are you thinking about mixtape album? Uh, anything, or you still going nah, single by single? I, I was pushing. A, um, I was making a mixtape on the low. You feel me? Making a mixtape. I was pushing single every. I was keep dropping singles, single, yeah. single. Facts, bro. What was gonna be the project thing? What happened with it? Project? Nah, it's gonna drop. It's about to drop. It's gonna drop August. I'm gonna let it drop August. Project is gonna be dead memories. Hmm. 
That's a lot. That's a, that's a lot on there. A lot. Some new stuff added. It's definitely a lot on there. But you seem excited about it. So yeah. like, this is something you've been working on holding yeah, it. I was holding it for my long. My long I was holding it. I was holding it for a reason. They gonna see the reason. See, I think, you want to know, I mean, as an outsider, everybody goes, Kuda be not serious, he don't want this shit, he just be doing music and want to dance. This is the real, Fact. like, this is what people are saying. I ask niggas, what's up with Kuda be? And they be like, that nigga playing, bro, he don't want this shit, he put out a record and then chill and then go on, go off the internet, don't thing. post. I this is the normal. I just normal. like to have fun. Like, they don't see me on the gram, Facebook. <laughs> I'm always on Facebook, yeah. 24-7, I love Facebook. Facts, <laughs> boy. I know mad people be like, why could it be don't be on the gram? numbers up. I don't, yeah. I don't care. I don't care about. I don't care about none of that. I really don't. Yeah. I don't care about no gram. I love Facebook. <laughs> <laughs> Facebook. 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 Nah, yeah, like the beginning of last year, I stopped writing. Mm -hmm. I just started going in the school, just go. Oh, from that end, I was asking from a different end, more about like getting records from niggas. Oh, what's the name, like? Nah. Not into it? Nah. It, are you are you looking down at that, or you just don't feel like it's going to connect for with you? Yeah, nobody going to feel how I really feel. Nobody going to know how I yeah. really feel about the music, you feel me? Yeah. So you just rather be from your yeah. pen or your mind or whatever yeah, like that. Facts, bro. Yeah. Speak creative. Be myself. Is rap becoming easier for you? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> At first it was a joke and now it's just Yeah, first it was a joke. Now it's just like Go. <laughs> go. <laughs> Don't play. Go. 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 You got so much energy, bro. I'm being honest, it's frustrating to see it because <laughs> You got all of this potential. It's like, why you not? You you should have been on tour. You should have been on stage. You get like, oh, you are you have potential to be like a top five at least, easy top seven New York artists. Like literally, if you took rap serious for a ninety day run, you could be top five, top seven rappers in New York. Everybody included, pretty fast. But it's just <laughs> this is crazy shit. <laughs> I don't know, bro. Other people. Don't you don't want a million dollars. dollars. You don't yeah, want. Yeah, it's, it's gonna come. It's gonna come. Watch. It's on the way. It's on the way. Okay. Real soon, like real soon. So me having fun. It's gonna come with me having fun. Yeah. Facts. I'm not feeling fair. I'm not running to. I'm not like, rushing to it. It's gonna come. I know it's gonna come. Yeah. So all of this shit goes down. You put out this project. It's gonna change the whole temperature. But now you have a different hurdle that's going on. Mm -hmm. So you're not going to be around. So early in the year, your name is mixed up with all of the 6 9 shit and all of the bad. To what ex like what were they charging you with? Hey, fucking. I was, I was charging Rico charge. Like, man, I don't even know. I wasn't paying that shit no mind. Cause that, like, <laughs> that shit is like. Politics. And now I was paying that attention, bro. You feel me? But me being me, I'm just like, all right, bro. Maybe this happening for a reason, bro. You feel me? I, I, I was just sitting back, bro. You feel me? Not stressing myself. I was living my life. Yeah. That's it, bro. So you're just chilling in the crib one day. Yeah. This is really, put me in that day. Let's go back to that day. Because you didn't know what the fuck. <laughs> you was on Facebook that day probably. Like, <laughs> oh, yo. I was, I, was on a, I was sitting in the car chilling. Chilling. Talk to somebody, and somebody texted me an article. I'm like, what the fuck? I look, I'm like, what the fuck? Me? Hold on, nah. Let me refresh this. This is not cool. They going crazy. It's my first time ever getting arrested. You know me? Yeah. I'm like, all right, hold on. I look, same to TMZ. I'm like, oh no, nah, this is real. So what did the TMZ article actually? What was that first article saying? That they were looking for you? Yeah, that, that no, yeah, Cooley B was on a run. Oh, I did see that. Okay. Like, right. I'm like, what? So you didn't even know that they was looking, yet alone they say you already on the yeah, run. Yeah, facts, but I didn't even know they was looking. The internet know. is just fake. Like, no, okay, now that you're a part of something, let's yeah. before we go further on that, you're a part of something where you go, 
does it now make you look at the internet even crazier? Because you're yeah. like, yo, bro, this is totally a That's lot. A like, fact. it's not even a little, like. That's a fact, bro. The internet is like, it will blind a lot of people. It definitely will. Yeah. It will blind you. Don't let it blind you. It will definitely blind a lot of people. Mm-hmm. OD, bro. That shit was just fucking my head up. I'm like, what the fuck? Nah, this shit is. Every time I refresh my phone, seeing new shit on Instagram, I'm like, nah, this is. And I don't even know about it. I'm right on the car. What the fuck? They just go crazy. I don't want to run. This is crazy. Yeah. It is. <laughs> it's, it got to like, I remember when I seen it. Okay, so what's your first thoughts when that happens? Is it like, yo, who put me in the mix of this? Are you feeling violated? Are you just panicked? Like, you not. I'm what's just the... like, what the fuck? Like, my hell is just like, I'm just like, what? Yeah. Question myself, like, what? Shit crazy. Yeah. At first, I'm just like, nah, this shit not real. Like, it can't be real. I woke up the next day, I'm like, this shit real. Yeah. That I, <laughs> I see that again. Still not I'm on the run. Yeah. But there's more articles yeah, coming. Bro, I'm like, nah, this is crazy. What? Let me ask a question I didn't ask earlier. What was FOA, your friends, your neighbor, what's their mindset like when you was supporting 6 9 prior to the mess? My mans love me. They support me regardless. Like, no, not you. Were they cool with your support of Takashi? Yeah, they going back anything oh, I do. Be. My mans going back anything I do. A lot of other people was talking, calling them dick riders, dog riders. They going back anything I do. Those yeah. are my mans. Hmm? Like, I remember I got a lot of flack at the beginning. I mean, I'm from Canada, from the floors, from the hundreds. They're like, what are you doing? And I just was like, I think the kids are going to be huge. I love it. You know yeah. what I mean? They got stand up niggas around it. It looks great. The records are crazy. And at the end of the day, I'm in the music business. You get what I mean? Like, gang shit is cool, but gang shit literally gets you to, like, a certain extent. It's not what people hype or think it is. Gang shit ain't really worth nothing past high school shit. Once you've grown in gangbanging, it is a guarantee of jail or death. It's not even a possibility. And nobody gonna do nothing for you when you're in there. Yeah. Nobody gonna come. That's when you really gonna see who real, who fake. Yeah. That's it. When it just gets to that point. Yeah. So, at what point do you you get you get brought in? Yeah. And then um, they came and arrested you. You turned no, yourself. No, I'm turning myself in. Cause you like this is. Yeah, hell yeah, I'm not gonna keep doing this. Yeah. Um, uh, this is crazy. Cause then every day you get more and more paranoid. Mm -hmm. I was paranoid. I didn't know what the fuck was going on. I'm not even in articles. But. I guess this is why the conversation I wanted to have this conversation with you because not anybody can have a conversation with you and it, it get even to the same point to understand the shit, to even understand the relationship, how it's supposed to look, how it's not. Nice. Um, I'm paranoid every day because I'm like, I don't know what's going to go on. Every day there's a new thing. Takashi snitching. Takashi tells this. No, he's not. He's not answering. He's not picking up. When that all goes down and you heard everything with the indictment regularly, your mindset was what? Oh, no, no, I was like, shit can be real. Facts. But, yeah, bro, then I, like, when I was about to turn myself in, that's when I was ready. I'm like, yeah, it's real. It's mm -hmm. real, real, real. I woke up. This shit real. Day by day, I'm like, yeah, this shit getting real and real and real. Yeah. Just getting real and real. I'm going to go, man. <laughs> that ass. It should not have been funny, but that ass, I swear to God, bro. I was just like, shit getting real and real. Yeah. Does it at that at that point are you are you like mad at Takashi like it, like straight up and down you're in the indictment because of what is did he did he implicate because I know what the internet the yeah, internet says what, yeah that's what they saying he implicated me saying I did it I mean I had something to do with it I guess I don't know bro me I really <laughs> I just, like, <laughs> I pay that shit no vibe bro yeah I really. I always forgive, bro. I mean, I always forgive. I never forget. Yeah, never forget. I always forgive. Bro. I ain't worrying about that shit, bro. So you uh, like forgiving to what extent? Like you're not angry at him anymore? No, I'm not angry at none of that shit, bro. I'm not even angry, bro. Just want to wow. do it, do get back to these kids, keep inspiring these kids. I get you. Keep doing what I do, regardless. You see, I had a convo with Shadi. I don't know if you've seen it. It went up on the internet for like only a couple hours. Mm. And then the lawyers called me and asked me to take it down, which is kind of ridiculous because it's the internet. It's mm -hmm. still on the internet. It's just not on my page anymore. Mm -hmm. It did like 300,000 views in an hour and a half. <laughs> like, put your shoddy on the phone. 
and what? Shadi comes on the phone, says one negative thing, and the rest positive. He goes, he's a rat bastard, but I forgive the little kid. And I remember, I was like, Shadi, you dead ass? And he said, yeah. And I just, so when you say, yo, I forgive, and just don't forget, it, I immediately thought about Shadi and go, holy shit. Like, I don't, it, it's not even, nothing direct, direct, direct to me, but indirectly with Crippy and with Shadi and with Ish and Ro and Mel, Harv, everybody that's in it, it, I still take it away to where it's like, I don't even forgive them. So I, it's a unique thing to hear that you who got to actually now go through a whole court thing, which then led to everything as we want to progress with the story. It's, it's kind of shocking to hear it. I didn't think that you would be so cool with it. Not mad or bothered by how your emotion is. I just was more shocked. So you, you go through the shit. They tell you that he's basically put your name in it. At that point, you now got to make the decision with your family, your team, your lawyers and everything. And then you pleaded guilty. Yeah. So with that being said, what are they saying now? Uh, I found out in October. <laughs> so what did you plead guilty to? Like, I made a soul. I get you. You keep it so cool. I'm humble, I'm humble, bro. Yeah. I'm really humble, bro. Yeah. Do you feel, I mean, this is a, that's a hard question to answer, but what do you feel like is going to be the thing that you miss the most in the time? Family, music? Going to the schools. I, I love that shit. It's shirt, the kids, bro. bro. You really. I love that shit, bro. I love What's like the craziest thing a kid has ever told you? Inspirational wise, story wise, kid. like. Cry. I seen the kid cry. Oh my god, god. this is really cool to be. Can you write your name on my arm? <laughs> For real? I'm like, nah. I'll be, nah, this is crazy. Right, let me sign the arm. <laughs> let me sign the good arm. <laughs> tears. Right, yeah, tears. Tears, tears. Several times. I had a lot of kids cry. I said, I was dying to meet you. Oh, they just want to meet you. Yeah. You know what's a unique thing? A lot of people. When I'm seeing a crowd of artists is because they connect to a story, mm -hmm. a moment. Like, yo, my dad died like your brother. You know, something that they connect with. What do you think that they connect with you? You say you connect with them because you see them and you. What do they... They connect the, the dancing I'll be doing. They, <laughs> they love just it. love it. They love it. Yeah. They love it. They love the dancing. And I'll be entertaining. I'll be talking to them on Snap. Talking to them on Snap. I reply back to kids. A lot of people don't be doing. They be acting Hollywood like they, yeah, they do. Good. That's a fact. I'm not too good. Um, keep writing me kids. I keep replying to y'all. Keep talking to y'all. <laughs> Get them make their day regular, bro. It's all, bro. I'm for the kids. That's it. Are you mad that this happens? Cause it kind of yeah. tarnishes you. Yeah, hell yeah. I am mad. I am mad, but like I said, because your image was it was a certain way. So you was gonna get a public yeah. school tour. You was gonna get a high school tour. You was that, gonna bro. do this. Yeah, so now that they bro. put like a that shit, they fucked a it up. Criminal. That shit is terrible now. Yeah, they fucked it up. But then now you have an opportunity to do two different routes. You either like leave it, or now you come back double as hard. And now you like, I got programs for kids to. Nah, I'm coming back. Yeah. Even more geeked up. Could it be the geek? Yeah. They know. Watch even more. You had a million dollars today. What do you do? I'm investing in a, I'm investing in stuff for the kids. A community center. For me. Um, um mad stuff to keep kids out of trouble. If if you had like that live community center, does your life change, you feel? Oh hell yeah. Hell huh. yeah, bro. Hell and it's just been a totally different If I did that, like if, if I really get a million dollars and make that, it's over, bro. No, I mean if you had a community center growing up, does your does cool to be change you get what I mean? Like do you yeah. still feel like you'd have been on the same show? You probably oh, would have nah, took some more and more. Yeah, I probably would have took it more serious. Because the opportunities. Yeah. Huh. Definitely. Definitely. I get you. Definitely. Even you know a lot of people do now, they put studios in the community centers now mm -hmm. and then, you know, let everybody go crazy. You got you got this whole scenario coming up. You're about to go away for a while. You want to launch this whole album or EP or project, however you go. What do you want the streets to feel? What do you want Kuda B to feel like when you're go away for this little stint? Like I'm still here. I'm still here. Watch. And they're going to feel like that too, like I'm still here. You got a couple of videos coming out. Couple. How many? I don't know if you want to say the number, but it's a couple. A clip. 
<laughs> Snow, it's a long, <laughs> it's an old story. Watch. Yeah. Watch a lot of videos. Definitely a lot. Just back to back. Back to back. You dropping them on your own, doing World Stars again? Yeah, I might. Yeah, hell yeah, I, I might do World Stars, like couple, my own couple, something like that. Yeah. Do you like, like, how do you look at? See something that's so trendy now, and I'm just curious on it. CC show. Um, that's my shit. I, I, I mean, you go I to dance. Shit, you was going crazy on the dancing. Yeah, I love that shit. You like it? Yeah. Some people are mixed on the CC show. Yeah. Some people be dead. Going hard, telling them what they want. That's you doing that. He not make you do that. CC not make you do he that. He does show the rub some people. Yeah, he do that. He get you there. Wait, what you said? Yeah. What you said, my nigga? Facts. Oh, what? Hey, people be so dumb You gonna slap him answer. one, nigga. People <laughs> be so dumb to answer. That's people doing that. Yeah. If he not doing nothing. He doing what he got to do. No way to do. Spicing him. Spicing him. I feel, me personally, I feel identical to how you said Because at the end of the day, CC is a kid from uptown to where it's like, he like, nigga, I'm a man, you're a man. I, I, I don't make you do nothing. I just That's ask you questions. If you now you jump off the bridge, right, jump off the bridge, add next live. You get what I mean? Like, and then now it's this whole enigma. You go on a CC show and you literally probably have the most fun in CC show's history. Yeah, yeah, people be really mad and I really don't be mad. <laughs> I really be laughing. People come on there and be angry. People be tight. People be feeling. With you? Yeah, people be tight, yo. They don't be knowing me. They do not be knowing me. That's why I, I go up with that couple of that. CC, ask him, do he know me? Come boy. That's it, bro. <laughs> do you know me? That's it, bro. I People get you. They be really mad, though. They be mad. I ain't mad at it. Right, so I'm we're... not mad, because like, people be talking. I don't pay them no mind. I don't pay them no mind. I don't pay them no mind. That kindness. Killing with kindness. That's all I do, bro. Yeah. Do you, with this all being said, if, to, to tap back on it, because it's a curious thing, if Takashi gets out this year like they're saying he's supposed to, does he still have a career? Mm, uh, I don't know, I don't know. You know, this generation is different, bro. Yeah. People don't care, but I don't know. He probably do, probably don't. I don't know, bro. I think he still has a career. Yeah, I don't think do. that it's as gonna be successful like that in America, because mm -hmm. I think America's too mixed into hood rappers and hood things. Yeah, I still think that he's gonna stream a lot because people are just nosy. Yeah, yeah they want. You get what I mean? Like they're gonna come. He's gonna clout chase. He's gonna diss. Probably tell me suck his dick. He's gonna tell everybody. Might tell you suck his dick. But it's fuck him too. This is what it is. He's a mm -hmm. clout kid. You get what I mean? I understand that, but I, you know, I still look at him the way that I look at him for his behavior on it. You get what I mean? Similar to the CC show, no one put a gun to his head to make him do anything that they say he allegedly did or he did not You get what I mean? Everything that they say you did, everybody is their grown man. Two arms, two legs, own mouth, own heart. You can choose to do anything that you want. Mm -hmm. So for when you go get in trouble and now go A B C D E, it's it's, it's you know, it's hard for me to forgive that. Because I know that there have been multiple times where you could just go, I don't want to get in the car, bro. Mm -hmm. I want to go home. You get what I mean? I just want to go home and get the fuck out of here. But if you stay in the car, you stay in the car. You get what I mean? So at that point, which is why I think it makes you extra, extra, extra A1. Mm -hmm. It's because you go, all right, cool. Whatever, which I said I did it. They, uh, you, you got me, maybe, kind of. All right, cool. I'm guilty, whatever. Let's get past it. Let's get back to what I was doing. Get back to my family. Get back to the kids. Yeah. Get back to the business. Right. Instead of being like, you probably could have went, well, Tom, Kevin, Sean, this is what happened. I don't know. I was I was on Facebook. Mm -hmm. You know, be like, and not to make a joke out of it, but you feel it. You get what I mean? Right. Like, if you could go right now and add some features to some artists with you like now that you are going to be you're, you're getting bigger and bigger this comes out we start posting we get it so much awareness now about you because no one gets to hear you talk much you're either laughing dancing or rapping you get what i mean so now might be the longest that they're actually able to hear us talk nah, it's the longest they hear me talk the longest they ever heard it changes it interviews change niggas careers not to be funny because it allows people to go i understand him i know why he is the way that he is why did you not do interviews before I wasn't really into it. Like, I don't like talking. I just like showing. I mm -hmm. like showing. 
I say something here and there. Watch, I'm gonna do this, do that. I'm gonna make it happen. I don't like talking no more. Yeah. As I say, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Yeah. Make it happen. Yo, I watch basketball a lot, right? So I'm in a draft classes. Who's your draft class now? Who do you feel like is in your draft class? Who are your peers that you go in three, four, five years? These are gonna be the guys who control New York with me. Mm, let's say me. Who I think gonna last for real, for real? Let me see. Let me see. Who gonna be? Damn. <laughs> right now is <laughs> I know who I wanna say, but I wanna I diss this like, nigga. Yeah, I wanna like think I'm trying to be funny. Oh, I'm, I'm dead ass serious. Uh, let me see who I think will last. I got kids. Watch. I'm. I'm definitely gonna be. Here for a long, long watch. I promise you that. Um, so let's go with the starting five. Starting That's safe. Five. All right, but I can say my little man JD. JD mm -hmm. gonna be here. Uh, uh, pop. Fuck with pop. Which pop? Pop smoke. Okay. Facts. Yeah, I fuck with Pop too. He got a, he got a sound. We, we stamping he, it. He hear like somebody. He, he sound like somebody. I know <laughs> that ass. <laughs> Pop, um, um, um. What else? Bleezy. My son Bleezy gonna be here. D.O.D. Yeah, definitely. Bleezy. Um. Let me see who I know. Who I... Chef. Chef won't lie. <laughs> I fuck with Chef. My son Chef. Definitely go live. He another one that got a unique voice and a unique That's sound. That's a fact. That's a fact. My son Chef. Chef on last. Uh, and one more? One more. Let me see. Hmm. What else? Uh, uh, um, who else, bro? Damn. Why are you really smoking like that? <laughs> <laughs> Cabin, yeah. Cabin. Yeah. You feel me? I can't even vouch for a lot of people, bro. <laughs> like the people I vouch for, people are, I, I know. No really know. Um, my son Pito Escobar, he gonna be here for a okay. watch. watch. I mean, it's a draft class, so you seeing it before it happened. That's a fact. If that's what it is, if he ain't mm -hmm. where he is now, mm -hmm. when you saying in five years, you feel like yeah. oh, that's a five. He's definitely gonna be smoking watch. I like that. Definitely. That's that confidence that your friends have in you, so now you. Pushing it off on him. Fact, bro. And you know, life is weird. You mm -hmm. go away now, he might go, yo, cool, it's not here. I gotta pick the fucking slack up. And go crazy. Yeah. Facts. I get it. What do you wanna leave the people with? Definitely. I'm gonna leave them with. I'm gonna leave to the kids. Stay positive. Mm -hmm. Stay positive. Look at this situation. This situation is something minor. Definitely gonna come back extra strong. Yeah, I know I'm gonna come back. New moves. No wolves, moonwalking, still moonwalking. Young Mike Jack, y'all know. Just all the kids stay in school. All the kids, I, I still remember everybody's face. I still remember all the schools I went to. When I come back, I promise I'm going up to them schools. Like, all the kids, never let nobody bring you down. Never let nobody bring you down. Never let situations bring you down. Never let nobody tell you you cannot do what you want. Yeah. You know what they're going to ask you at the end of the day when you do it? How you do that? So I made the song. <laughs> <laughs> For real, that's all they go ask. He liked that segue. That segue was so smooth. Uh, 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 he said, punch you people in my press getting up. Facts. My come press voice getting up. Come on. He said, I threw that right in there. I wrote they, they didn't think I was coming with that right there. <laughs> I, 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 I'm not mad at you. Yo, Facts. man, listen. I'm gonna the camera's rolling, so this is like the confirmation. I'm mm -hmm. putting out this album. Am I getting a cool to be verse? Facts, we're gonna get a cool to be verse. So that's it. Yeah. So we gotta, cause I, I wanna, I'm gonna listen. We trying to make this to new Khaled. Like I, shout out to the big bro Khaled. A lot of you know what the people don't do? They don't shout out somebody if they like. I, it, I, he inspires me. I, I, I look at what Khaled does and what he continues to do as something that I want to do. I mm. wish that I could have eight Ace Hoods and then Rick Rosses and then T Pick. You know what I mean? Like I will. And, you know, these are the markets that do it, but I want to put together this project. So now that labels feel like punches should, it can, can take a couple million dollars, let's fund this fucking project. That's let's put fun. it on radio. Let's get it everywhere. And now I want it to just be Young New York. Mm -hmm. Or at least all New York. Let me not just say Young New York, because maybe we put in like an OG here and there, but I want it to be New York the first time yeah. to where our sound I'm gets out there. Bobby, too, bro. Are you fuck with Bobby? Energy different, bro. I spoke to Bobby... Yeah. 
Three days ago? I speak to Bobby all the time. Energy different, bro. He gonna last too. He definitely gonna last on this Brooklyn shit. He comes out next summer. Real niggas. It's gonna be a different thing. That's crazy. I speak to Bobby all the time, man. We got something cooking too, you fucking bastards. Because they think that I'm the one that's like... They feel... I don't know what they think. But you know, they think that I like cop Jane and sit down, though, man. But it's good. Y'all don't know about the conversation that's going on. Cool B is good. All right, motherfuckers? All right, he's there. I wanted to know it. He's happy. He loves Facebook. He can dance better than you <laughs> niggas. You get what I'm saying? Definitely. He can dance better than you niggas. Definitely. And then he got a project coming. And the project is coming when again? It's going to come August. There it is. Dead. Dead memories. There it is. I ain't mad at it. It's punch. We moving. Cool to be going to be good. We going to keep this shit moving. Definitely. Post this up everywhere. On Facebook, too. We don't want no problems. <laughs> but, but it's moving. There it is. Shout out, Cool B, F away. Whatever you want to do. All right, yo, punch. Shout out, my man, punch. Love, man. That's my guy, man. He no, took man. way too fucking long for this. <laughs> Understand? But we finally here. I ain't mad at it. Bow. <laughs>